Hey everybody, my name is Travis is Travis Backpools, and we're back with NBA Hoops Premium Stock. I have one blaster box here. Why? Because this blaster box cost me $65. Now, I don't want to open it up that bad to where I'm going to justify spending another $65 to get two blaster boxes on here, which is what I usually try to do when I open up blasters. But this is enough to at least let me see what I'm working with, what we're going to get out of here, you know, what the possibilities are. There's only 32 cards in here, so it's four cards per pack and eight packs per box. So still, I did want to see what it looked like in person. And I'm not going to go crazy and buy a whole bunch of these out on the uh, open market so or the resale prices. So I at least wanted to get one, and that's what we're going to do here. We're going to open this bad boy up and hopefully get something good. You know, a John Morant rookie card would be really nice, but we'll see what happens. If you guys are enjoying the content, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And let's go ahead and jump into this box. All right, and here it is, NBA hoops premium stock blaster box i am actually really excited to get into this because um i you know i want like i want to i don't like regular nba hoops but the idea of a premium stock version of it, so like a chrome version of it um is, is pretty enticing to me um seems very very like it'll look really good i've seen pictures and they do seem to look pretty good so yeah, we'll uh, hopefully get some good stuff in here. The exclusives in this box are the Silver Mojo Prisms. Uh, we can get some autographs out of there. And then the Red Prism, Blaster Exclusive Red Prism. So Silver Mojo and Red Prism is what we're looking for. But uh, yeah, other than that, I'm pretty excited. It will be a pretty quick video. I don't have 10 minutes to waste your time uh, with this box, so I can't sit there and drag you guys on. So we're just going to go ahead and jump into this guy, see what we can get. Hopefully, we can pull out a... A jaw Morant. That's like what I'm looking out for out of here is just a jaw. I don't need a, a Zion. I'll take a Zion, but I already would like a jaw. So here we go. We got Dion Waiters, Eric Bledsoe, Quindary Weatherspoon. There's the rookie. Ooh, and a Grant Williams refractor. I'll take it. I'll take a Grant Williams refractor. Everything uh, rookie and uh, ref parallel basically needs to be sleeved up at this point because oh, the basketball market's insane. These are $20 boxes. They are now $65. They were when I bought this on the retail market or resale market, which is just freaking madness. Just absolutely insanity. That looks like a insert of some sort. Reggie Jackson, Myers Leonard, Rajon Rondo, and then Vince Carter Red. I'm assuming this is one of the um, the exclusive ones to the box the red prisms i mean that's kind of cool vince carter his last year um yeah and it's uh matches his team colors that's kind of cool i'll sleeve it up you know why not why not i can't imagine it's worth anything but it is a parallel and who doesn't love or you know at least somewhat like vince carter he is Tracy McGrady's cousin, which is Tracy McGrady is one of my favorite players. After Hakeem Olajuwon took over, Tracy McGrady became the uh, my favorite player in the league. I think we have a silver mojo in here. Uh, Karis LeVert, Brandon Ingram, Dwayne Wade tribute. If those are, I'm, I'm not a Dwayne Wade fan whatsoever. Never really liked Dwayne Wade, so yeah. Oh, just not. Ooh, come on, baby. Oh, God. Please be John Morant. God dang it, Kyle Anderson. You son of a mother lover. That's that's unfortunate. What a tease. What a tease. I mean, the, I, like the, I like that look, though. The silver mojos. Those look really good. You guys can get a better look at it. Very cool. Yeah, I like that. Well, it was better, definitely better than the uh, red. Definitely better than the red. All right, here we go. Austin Rivers, no longer a Houston Rocket. We got a silver in here or an insert. Nikola Nikola Vucevic. We've got Admiral Schofield as our refractor and a zero gravity. I can never remember how to pronounce this guy's name. I hear it and I forget. Hamido. It's Diallo. I know that part. I don't. I don't remember how to pronounce his first name. But I'll sleeve it up. Zero gravity inserts are pretty cool, especially in this premium stock. So that's number one. I'd like a, I wish they had Lou Dort. That's who I want. 
I tried to find some rookie cards for the door, and apparently he, they didn't put a whole lot into any of the product. Because I, out of all the product I opened up for basketball this year, I don't have any Lou Dorts. So. All right, we got Wendell Carter Jr., Vince Carter Base, Cavaliers Alfonso McKinney, and then our Refractor, Siku, Langston Galloway. Oh, that's unfortunate. <clears throat> that is unfortunate. We did not, did we not hit a rookie in that pack at all? I don't think so. It doesn't look like we did, which is, that's real bad. Now, I don't, you don't, definitely don't want to go with only eight packs. Four cards, you don't want to miss out on at least one rookie. All right, uh, looks like another insert. Wilson Chandler, Damian Lillard, Mifiondu Cabangeli, and our oh Dennis Schroeder. Oh, this is a um, this is actually a parallel. Is this numbered? No. Huh. It's just a green and blue parallel. It's really cool. I like that look. I don't. I mean, wish it was a different player, you know. But um, still, very a very clean looking uh, parallel. Silver Mojo, red. What is this? This is a. I'm looking over here because I want to see what this is. Base silver, green prism. Is that green? Maybe that might be. I think that might be green. So green. Yeah, looks like it's just a green. So the blue just, I think, is because of his jersey. All right, we got two packs left. We have hit no good rookie cards. So here's another silver mojo. All right, we got Justin Jackson, Jeff Teague, Zion. There we go. Yes. And then our silver mojo is going to be Bojan Bogdanovic. Bogey. This is, I mean, we... We, this whole pet box was basically we got what we came for. I have no idea what Zion premium stocks are going for at all. I don't know if they're going for, I can make my money back or not, but um, I ain't mad that I got one. Get that in there. I'm just happy, yeah, I got one. There we go. It's like dust on it or something on the top loader. But yeah, I'll take it. I'm very happy to that we did not walk away empty handed. Definitely happy we didn't walk away empty-handed. We got the cover, boy. All right, last pack. I want you guys out of here. All right, we got John Collins, uh, Demar Derozan, tribute to DeAndre Hunter. That's uh, I'll set that one aside. And something weird, courtside Paul George. Oh, I remember these ones. These ones are... I'm not a big fan of these ones, like, at all. But these inserts. And Paul George. Yeah. Not a big Paul George fan either. But I'll take this DeAndre Hunter. And I just bumped the camera. I'm getting pretty consistent at doing that. Which is unfortunate. Oh, I guess I'll top load it. Like, I'm so scared of, like, what's... Not, not scared, but unsure of what's important in basketball nowadays. Because everything's expensive. And it, the dumbest stuff could be worth money, you know, and I don't want to mess them up. So I top loaded that. I need to sleeve the Miafiandu and the Admiral Schofield and, uh, and Quindary Weatherspoon. And then I'll, I'll get us out of here. All right. All right. And I'm back. So we'll go ahead and go through what uh, I think, what I, what I deem sleeve worthy. First being uh, Mafiandu Capingelli, uh, Admiral Schofield, uh, Quindary Weatherspoon, and then we got a bunch of, uh, there's actually another rookie back in here too, but a bunch of parallels, Bo uh, Bogey, Dennis Schroeder, Green, Langston Galloway, Refractor, uh, Diallo, Silver, Kyle Anderson, um, Silver Mojo, Red, Vince Carter, uh, Grant Williams, Refractor, actually I'm, I'm gonna top that one, DeAndre Hunter, Tribute, and then uh, Zion, which is the premium card of the pack. Um, I stopped kind of putting prices of what or what they're valued at when I pulled them on the screen. Uh, and when I do videos, it just takes a long time to edit. But if you guys did enjoy that and liked it, I just didn't, there wasn't enough like feedback from them. So I didn't think they were needed. But if you guys liked them, I'll bring them back where I'll, guys show, you, I'll show you what these things are worth. Um, and stuff like that so we got zion 
can't be mad at that. I hope you guys did enjoy. That was a little, you know, it was pretty fun. Um, it's always a lot of fun opening up basketball when I when I can actually get my hands on it. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time.